Hi guys, it's Amber from Amber Eats Books and I'm here today to do a mid-year goals check-in. So I went back and I re-watched the video that I made at the beginning of this year, just listing all of the goals that I had for my reading and my channel and I just wanted to check in and see how I'm doing. I did okay in some of them. Other ones, eh, not, not so good, but let's see, <laughs> let's see where I triumphed and where I failed. So the first goal that I had for myself was my Goodreads goal. I wanted to set it to a hundred books and I'm actually on track. I've read 63 books so far, so I'm 14 books ahead of schedule, which is fantastic. I set it at a reasonable goal, so I was hoping to meet it and exceed it, um, but if I don't exceed it, that's fine. The second goal that I had for myself was to read more nonfiction. Last year, I only read four nonfiction books and I wanted to read one book per month in 2017 that was nonfiction. So far this year, I have read 13 nonfiction books, which I'm just flabbergasted by because it has never been a go-to genre for me, but now it is, it's becoming one, especially on audiobooks. I love listening to nonfiction audiobooks. They are just so informative and really engaging, more so than I thought they would be last year at this time so the third goal that i had set for myself is to read not only more diverse books but different structured books like short stories poems classics even i don't read enough of those and i will say i feel like i've been reading a little more diversely than last year but i've not really picked up i don't think i've read any short stories i've not read any poem collections and I've only read like two classics so far this year so I need to pick that up a little bit in the second half of the year. My fourth goal for myself was to read what I own and or borrow from the library. I feel like I've been doing a really good job with that. Most of the books I've read have either been books that I own or books from the library. I just currently in the last couple of months have bought some books but still the number I feel like has been under 20 books so far this year that I've bought. I do plan on going to my library book sale next week so that may change um, but so far I really am proud of myself for reading mostly what I own and borrowing from my library. The fifth goal that I had for myself was to read more Stephen King. I had planned to read his books in somewhat chronological order or even just to reread his books at all. I also wanted to finish the Dark Tower series reread that I was doing. I have read the first four books last year and so far this year I've not read any Stephen King. So I'm hoping to remedy that this month to start anew but we'll see how it goes. I just there's been so many other books that I want to read that I just have not been reading Stephen King. So you win some you lose some but whatever. And my sixth goal, sixth, can I say that word? My sixth goal was to have a more regular uploading schedule. I feel like I've been pretty good at uploading my weekly reads videos right on Mondays on schedule. There have been a few weeks here or there where I've either skipped or I've had to post it a little later because life has just gotten in the way. But I do want to become more regular with my other videos such as my tags and discussions and wrap-ups and things like that. I would really like to have a set schedule. So that is definitely one of my goals to conquer over the summer before I go back to work. And my seventh goal was to do some vlogging and I've not done any vlogging at all. I would like to say that I'm definitely going to remedy that in the second half of the year, but I have no idea. Baby steps, we'll see how it goes, but so far I've not done any. And then my last one was I'd like to have more discussion videos on my channel. I have done a couple of discussion videos and they've gone over really well and I've enjoyed them. I just have been so busy with life that I haven't had a minute to really sit down and think and put another video like that together. They take more work than say a wrap up video does because obviously you've read the books, you know what they're about, you have stuff to talk about. Whereas discussion videos, you have to really script them a little bit more than a regular video. So those are all of my goals. I think I've done well with some of them. Other ones still need some work. How have you guys been doing this year? Did you guys set any goals that you did meet or didn't meet or have exceeded or decided to just scrap all together? Let me know down in those comments below because I would love to have a discussion about that. Anyway, I hope you have a great second half of 2017.